Doctors are increasingly using some forms of artificial intelligence or AI in, in the workplace, really commonly used in the hiring and recruiting processes. Um, the use of AI raises a host of legal issues, but one of which is how to protect those processes and the algorithms that go into the AI work and, and information that they're gathering. Um, there's several things that employers can do to try to protect this. Uh, first of all, you want to take a look at your uh, confidentiality agreements and make sure that the terms really cover everything you need to cover to properly protect these processes. I would say that most confidentiality agreements probably have some basic terms such as processes, algorithms, data or data analysis, metadata, um, device configurations, technologies. They protect these things generally, uh, but I think for those employers that are using AI more prominently within their uh, HR functions and other employment relations uh, capacities should really think about um, adding some additional terms, mostly to avoid any ambiguity. Um, so things like system elements, uh, neural networks, uh, training sets, uh, decision trees, these are all things that um, you want to make it unambiguous that you're trying to protect this information. One of the other particularly interesting issues is really whether the underlying data that the AI is manipulating and working on, whether that can be protected. And, and that's really going to probably depend on what the source of that data is. So if you're dealing with a publicly available information source and in the recruiting process where you're getting things from whether it's LinkedIn or Facebook and you're getting this uh, public other publicly available data, you might not be able to protect that, but you can protect what's done to it. Um, conversely, if the underlying data set is your human resources, files, and personnel information regarding your employee population, that material is probably already going to be protected um, within the terms of your confidentiality agreement.